Good morning, muchachos. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. It's Alondra's last day being seven. No, we're not supposed to be excited. We're supposed to be uh, sad. I am supposed to. <laughs> yeah, you are very excited. Good morning, baby. Hi. Someone woke us up early. And he is watching Baby Shark. So it is Alondra's, oh, look at my phone. It is her last day being seven. Her birthday is tomorrow, but she is doing um, some birthday festivities today. Somehow, oh, got a text from Walmart. Cupcakes are ready. Perfect. That's on the to-do list actually is to pick up her cupcakes for um, school tomorrow. But I have such a long to-do list. Honestly, I feel like it's not gonna be that bad, but um, somehow Alondra swindled us into a party, you know? Um, so she... But it's not like a normal No, it's not like... So we do birthday parties every other year, just in case anyone is new. Um, so last year she had a party at Urban Hair, so this year would be like a non-party, and then the next year would be a party. So that's just how we do it. Um, but this year she wanted her friends to come over for cake and to sing happy birthday and I said that was fine. And then um, we always do an activity and so I was asking her what she wants to do. She wanted to get a manicure, get her nails done, but she also wanted her friends to come. So it turned out, she, and it's not like a ton of friends, she's just inviting her three best friends. So it's a birthday play date is what we're calling it. Like a get together instead of a party party. Um, but yeah, so they're gonna go get manicures today, her and her three friends. Then they're gonna come back here, we're gonna do ice cream cake and sing happy birthday and then pizza. And I already picked up the ice cream cake, got it from Dairy Queen, so I hope it's good. Um, and last night I actually did film, which is gonna go up before this vlog. So if you haven't seen it and you wanna see it, um, it'll be up before this. I still haven't uploaded a vlog. I uploaded the Thanksgiving vlog and I still have to upload a couple others to be caught up I think. So I'm actually not vlogging a ton just because I want to kind of be up to date and current. So anyway, so I'm trying you guys, I'm trying. Um, but on my to-do list today I have, I want a vacuum because people are obviously going to be over so I want, you know, the floors to be vacuumed. I did vacuum yesterday but I want to just do it again because Wiggle sheds like crazy, so it doesn't even look like you vacuumed because of her hair. I wanna have the dishes done, so I mean, those are from last night, so I'll get those done. I wanna clean off this table, the dining room table. I wanna set up the decor. I, we don't have a ton of decor, but I do have like a balloon garland that is a lot bigger than what I originally thought, so I wanna get that done. Um, I want to pick up the couch, which is honestly easy to do, but I just have it on here. Make my bed, which is easy to do. I could do it right now, but I just have like little things on here just so I don't forget. But I wanna make sure all toys are put away and like random things. Uh, I need to go to Dollar Tree, which I'll probably do later tonight to be honest. Pick up the cupcakes and then that's it. So that is all, but honestly, what else is on here is to wash my hair. My hair is so greasy and just, yeah, it needs to get washed. So, you know, you know, Emilio, he's honestly so good in the morning. Like I can set him on there and he will pretty much stay for quite a bit. I don't know why he only does it though in the morning because like any out, like other time throughout the day, he'll probably do like five, 10 minutes max. But first thing in the morning when he wakes up, he is so happy and content in his swing. I'll put on something on like, you know, I'll put on like Canticos or Baby Shark or something and he's just like, good. Maybe it's because he's used to that because I have to get a laundry ready for school. I don't know. But since he is like so good there, I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hair because it is so greasy and I just, I just need to wash this thing. Hair is washed, so that's checked off the list. Now it's coffee time and I need to feed my baby because he's hungry. My two little loves are cuddling so stinking cute over here. Are you with your sister, papas? Yeah? Say, I was not happy in my swing. So I jinxed it. You. So sissy got you. Yep. And now you're happy. Say, mommy Say said hi. that I'm always good in the swing, so you know what? I'm a cry. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, so my mom, 
mother. Um, she sent packages for Elantra's birthday, of course. And of course she's so excited. She also sent a couple of like clothes for Emilio. So my mom called Alondra and was like, so are you gonna open up your presents? And I'm like, mom, it's not her birthday, no. So of course my mom's like, oh, come on, she has to. So Alondra didn't I say no. No, 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 we did not agree on all the presents. So she's going to open up one box. So these are the two boxes that she sent. And I think this one has brother's clothes. You think that one has brother's Cause clothes? Because it's over, maybe. So what we're gonna do is we're going to open up both boxes. Mom already wrapped them, and then she will get to, I don't know if we'll count them, but we'll see which ones she'll open. But you're saving some for tomorrow, for your birthday. I'll save the other box for tomorrow. Okay, that's what we'll do then. All right, well let's open up the packages. Oh, you better FaceTime Obach on. So that way she can watch you. Grandparents, I tell ya. Okay, Alondra opened up one box, so she's saving this box for tomorrow. And she got, what did you get? I got a hot chocolate bomb. Oh yes, a can hot you chocolate make that bomb. For me? Yeah, I can make that for you. Thank you. And then my mom, because we were awful and forgot to get a first Christmas ornament, my mom found this and got it for us. Thank the heavens, because I was so upset I did not get one. So shout out mom, you the real MVP. But what it. did you get? I got a Nintendo Switch game for Animal Crossing. I know, that's exciting. A lot of people told me that you would like that game. So okay. yeah, so I hope that you do. I, you basically, it's almost like Roblox, I feel like Adopt Me almost, because like you create a character, you go around, and you like create your own houses and villages, and then you can go to other people's lands and like trade characters. So I feel like it's similar to Adopt oh, yeah, Me almost. So close to Adopt Me. So if you don't know what Adopt Me is, it's a game on Roblox and you have pets, you can buy pets with your robots if you have robots. And you have to have Ro Roblox though to play Adopt Me. Yeah. And it's really fun, you collect pets and you can trade them and make build your house. Yeah, so I feel like if I'm not, if I'm understanding it correctly like this is kind of similar because yeah you can customize your own world and just like different things so okay, yeah yes i'll call it thank you and speaking of robux you did get four thousand five hundred and sixty five robux yes she got a gift card <laughs> for robux i got i did that the right math i got a boba boba squishmallow yeah she's obsessed with squishmallow so she got what's her name i haven't even read it how do you even say that? I think Jakaria? Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna change your name. You're gonna change the name? Okay. And then she got, what else? A bunch of... Clothes. Yes. And a card. And a card, yes. So nice. And then of course, to be continued tomorrow. And then brother, mom got him some really cute Valentine's Day clothes. Can I play on I mean, Roblox? Yes, you can play on Roblox. <laughs> She's like, I'm done. Um, but yeah, she got him three new outfits and they're all Valentine's outfits, which I love. I mean, you guys, these suspenders, I'm dead. How freaking cute. So she got him this outfit and this one that says Mr. Irresistible. Just so cute, the sweater. And then it has, uh-oh. I'm coming, Papas, I'm coming. These really cute pants. And then this, of course, we need this little, little Valentine one. Oh my God, little sleeper set. So stinking cute. Thank you so much, mom. But now I gotta go and get Emilio. I forget how hard it is to do like simple things, like eat when you have a baby. Emilio is like, no mama, you are holding me all day today. And I'm like, baby, I got things to do. Um, and I was feeling a little stressed, but I slightly feel a little bit better. One of Alondra's friends, the mom is gonna come over because she's really good at doing like the whole balloon garland situation. So, um, she actually last night, late last night, I think it was like 10, 11, I went to her house and she gave me like this balloon um, inflator because I didn't realize, uh, where is it? Where the hell is it? Uh, here it is. I didn't realize this had so many balloons. So I share all of like the Bucky's party decor stuff in um, that video. So if you wanna see everything in detail. But, so I was like, crap, I can't blow up balloons. So I knew she just did a balloon garland last month was her daughter's birthday. So I asked her like, 
if she did everything by mouth or if she had a machine and she said she had a machine so i went over to get it and then she's like if you want me to come over and help you with the blue garland i can and i was like ah no big deal but you know what i'm kind of like time is ticking it's almost 11 i think hey siri what time is it it's 10 59 a.m 10 59 yeah it's 11 o'clock um, and so I'm like, you know what? I would rather like have that up and done with than not, you know? So the only thing I really have is this and this um, to like put up on the wall. I also have a, what else do I need to pull out? I guess I need to pull out all of this to be honest. I have a tablecloth, I got plates, all of that I can set up. But like this or these two things I need um, with her for her um so yeah let me set these are alondra's presents set those to the side wrapping paper i'm gonna have to stay up late tonight and wrap um so any hoozy um yeah so she said she was going to get ready and come over to help me i feel really bad like i'm really bad at asking people for help with things i'm not good at that i'm always like i'll just stress myself out and i will figure things out and i will get things done um i don't know if that's like stubbornness or being hard-headed i don't know but like i just don't like to ask for help and i try to figure things out myself but i'm like you know what put my hands up and since she is good with it and she said it would be really quick might as well just have her help me like why not have the help especially if she offered so um she's gonna come over and we are going to knock that out which makes me feel better Ava is vacuuming the house. I already did the dishes, but I realized I hadn't eaten yet, like anything. So I was like, I need to scarf down something. So I just made myself a quick sandwich. So there's like two dishes in the sink, no big deal. Um, and I do need to do the table, just honestly clean it. And um, the little tray that has all of our, like that tray has become like our junk catch-all tray, honestly. And I'm just going to hide that in the guest bedroom like that's basically what i'm doing i've been like running around picking up things and like putting them in place aka hiding them you know i don't know why i'm stressing out it's not like a ton of people are coming over and they've all well have they actually like been physically inside like our really good friends that we're always with they have um and like they've seen our house not clean but i don't know if the other two i feel like they've been in like really briefly like their daughters obviously have been here play dates and stuff but like i don't know so i just wanted to look you know nice but i'm like that with everyone when my mom comes when my mother-in-law comes like i just want the house to look good i don't want it to look like a disaster and i did already clean alondra's bathroom i did that yesterday so that is clean and that is good um but anyways all right i'm gonna go ahead bring these out into the living room i put emilio down for a nap and then he woke up 15 minutes later of course like he literally just woke up as i was coming in here to like talk to you guys but at least he let mama eat so that is a good thing i did get to eat so anyways all right i'm gonna go ahead and bring these out here i think she said we she literally lives two streets away from me so she's probably gonna be like knocking on the door any second oh my god i am obsessed do you love it baby love it. you love it love it it looks so good so i'm so glad i asked her to come over and help with this because it literally looks amazing um and yeah i love it and then the number eight did not come with it my friend melissa went to dollar tree for me to get that big balloon and if you didn't know dollar tree sells these big balloons now they're five bucks but i mean it's better than party city prices so i'm obsessed i love it and then we have the tablecloth and the party hat and then the bucky's um plates and then I have the cake stuff here, which I'm just gonna leave out because it is a ice cream cake, so I don't want, you know, it to melt, obviously. And then we will have pizza, and Yadam says he wants wings, so we're gonna do wings as well. Hi, who only wants mama today and doesn't want mama to do nothing, huh? Who only wants the mamas to and himself? Then then we'll watch sissy. I or know, but he's been laughing super cute with you today, yeah. like super cute. So, like, ow, ow. Oh, you got my hair. You got my hair. But it's 2.25. We're going to leave here in about 20 minutes. Um, so I need to finish getting Alondra ready. Uh, Emilio threw up on her shirt that she's wearing. So I have that in the dryer. And she is going to wear her hair down. So I just need to brush her hair. So honestly, it's not going to be, it's not going to take long to get her ready. But I just want to have her like done and ready. So that way, you know, we can get to the nail salon. And I am so excited. It looks so freaking cute. You love it? I, I love it. Like, if you guys can get some Bucky stuff, like, highly recommend. 
I'm seriously like, I, I think this might be my favorite theme that we've done. Say, like, it's say, just say, I think it so is. freaking cute. You think so? Yeah, yeah I do too. Because we've done Descendants. What else have we done? Descendants last year was Candyland, but we didn't have like a lot of decor at the house. We just like had some stuff at Urban Air. Um, I mean, it was still cute lot. though. Yeah, we didn't have a lot, but we did Descendants. We've done Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. That was her first birthday. Um, she had like Frozen Elsa theme her third birthday. And then the well, fifth birthday was yeah, Descendants. Yep. Sixth, I did like a mermaid kind of like theme. And then last year was Candyland, and then this year is Bucky's. But and I think I the Bucky's is my favorite for sure. Like I just, it's so freaking cute. But what, so. what birthday will probably be my favorite. Yeah, the golden birthday. Next year, yeah, because we're gonna definitely do all gold, go all out for her golden birthday. But anyways, I'm excited. So, all right, I'm gonna stop rambling. See if this one will let me set him down. Hmm? Hmm? And that way I can finish getting Alondra ready and then Alondra can go and get her nails done. Are you excited to get your manicure? What are you gonna get done? A French tip. A French tip? Oh my God, you're grown, girl. We get to sit in the special tip. I know, for your nails. You never really saw you before. You excited? Yeah. Okay. You look like hands. That's good? That's super cool. Wow. Good. Fancy. It's really hard to do nail art. Yeah. So Look pretty. Good? Yes. You like it? You do like it? Yes. What do you say? Oh, yeah. Thank you. Oh, your Many hours later. Birthday play date is over. How much fun did you have, my love? Super. Super? And look at her. Such a good girl. She's working on her spelling words. Cause she's I got a. I got? Yeah, you can show them, but finish your spelling words first. Okay. She's got a spelling test tomorrow or a pre test tomorrow. I have so. a couple more anyways. You got a couple more and you're done? Okay, good girl. But unfortunately, our balloon arch fell down, but it's okay. We were able to get pictures, so that's good. Yeah, and you can sit under now, so that's fine. So we're gonna just leave it there. Adon just got home from Walmart and picked up the cupcakes. I just custom ordered these, I think I said that. Um, and then yeah, those are the cake top, or the cupcake toppers I will just put on in a little bit. But it was a really, really good time. Did you have a good time? Your sister's birthday party, papas? Did you have fun? Did you have fun? Did you have fun? That went blurry on us. How rude, huh? See how rude go blurry on me, huh? But yeah, it was good. It's on 7.50, so perfect, because Alondra goes to bed at 8.30 on school nights. So literally, perfect timing. It was, honestly, everything went really good, and her nails came out super cute. She can, you want to show Muchachos your nails? Look at those pretty, pretty nails. So she got French tip, and then she got like glitter put on them. And then this cool And then design. she got, yeah, super cool design the lady did. So fancy, love them. My little grown adult. And then she got a tattoo kit as one of her presents, so she's got a that on her tattoo. cheek. Super, super cool. Like, come no. So it was honestly like really good, yeah. and the kids all had fun. They all have fun, huh? See, they all have fun playing. And next year you'll be able to play, huh? Yeah. Next year you'll be able to run around and play, huh? Hey. Yes, yes. So anyways, I'm gonna go ahead. I need to help her finish with like the spelling words. Oh, she does want to show you her present. So we'll show you those in a second when she finishes that. And then I'm gonna have to do some late night birthday things. Hi guys, this is a mini haul that my friends got me for my birthday. So starting off for one of my best friends that I actually met in first grade. She got me a bead making kit. Look how big this is. No wonder why her present was so heavy. She also got me a card, which, you know. Hold on, let me go get something. Some robot from the same friend. And I got some Sour Patch Heart Sour Patch Kids. Like, I've never seen these. Like, I want to eat it, but it's too late. Don't worry, y'all. Don't get a sugar card before y'all go to, um, but remember, kids do not do that. And then we have this like hair cool making kit from another one of my friends that I actually met in like pre-K or kinder. 
and Kinder. And Kinder, which I knew her for a while. I met her in cheer. Yes. And then from a friend that I met like first, you know. Like she was like our, one of our first neighbors that we met. And she made me like a glitter tattoo. Okay, I have one on my cheek right now. I don't know if it will focus. But yeah, I have one on my cheek if you don't realize that. And then I have this cute hoodie and pants. Like I want to wear it tomorrow, but like, you know. Like with my headband, it probably won't matter. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm talking too much. And yeah, that's why my friends call me for my birthday. Thank you for my mini haul. Bye. I fell asleep, you guys. It's 11.30. <sighs> oh my God, I can't believe that. I was putting Emilio to bed and I knocked out. Go figure. My hair is kind of cuckoo. Thankfully, the stuff that I have to wrap isn't like too, too big, but I'm just like, oh man, I'm, I'm tired. So I just ran into the car and I got the balloons out of the car. Edom went to Walmart to get the cupcakes. I think I showed you guys that, right? Oh my God, I'm so tired. Um, and then he also went and got the balloons from Dollar Tree. And Alondra really wants to open her presents in the morning. I would, I just put the balloons in her room and it looks so stinking cute. Um, I don't know. It, it makes, okay, if you guys don't know, um, I put balloons in her room for however old she's turning. My mom did this for me when I was younger. She did it all the way up until I was 18. And then my hair looks crazy with this clip. Um, so it's something that I've started with Alondra. And I don't know, it's just... It's just fun because it's something that, you know, I had as a tradition growing up and now I'm doing it with her. So if she didn't want to open presents in the morning, I would totally like just, you know, like do it while she's at school. But she's very in like, wants, I, mean, I get it though. She wants to open presents in the morning. It is what it is, but I'm just like, fuck, I'm so tired. So, anyway, hopefully I can wrap these quickly and, I mean, thankfully she doesn't care about wrapping, so I'm going to try to wrap some of these, like, as quick as I can and then go back to bed because I'm so tired. Oh my god, this wrapping paper is thick. Wow, it is, like, heavy duty. Oh yeah, Bucky's wrapping paper. Of course. Wow, I'm impressed with how thick it is though. Holy cow. I know what you guys are thinking, okay? I know what you guys are thinking. to do this charm bracelet I'm gonna see if maybe I have a jewelry box like not a jewelry box but like yeah like a little jewelry boxing and then see if I can put this inside of it and then wrap it I'm I think I have something but I'm not 100% sure so I need to go in my room and check but the only thing I have left to wrap is this 
I have two other, oh shit, I have two other things that I have to get out of the room. Oh my God. It would be neat to like forget something, honestly. Like, it doesn't surprise me. white box I had to take some of my earrings out of it but it's perfect it'll hold the charm bracelet and then I got her or we got her um, an urban air gift card so I have that which I'm trying to decide do I want to wrap it or do I want to put it inside the card and then maybe oh, there's something that I need to print out um, so I need to decide how I want to do that. If I want to just put it in like the card as well. Ugh, didn't, didn't clearly think about this, but I have boxes. So I'm thinking maybe I'll print that out and put them inside a box and wrap it. I think I'm gonna do that because I honestly think that would be hilarious. Cause you know, it's like a huge box and she's gonna wanna open it. I think I'm gonna do that. Okay. I'm trying to decide too, like do I wanna keep the tags on? I think I'm going to just so like, I don't know, so like she knows, like they all go together. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that and like, oh, let me put tissue paper. All right, and I had red tissue paper too. So that way it'll look like a little bit nicer. And I know you guys are probably wondering, did you cry, Brittany? Yes, yes I did. Like it was, a laundry usually goes to bed at 8.30 on a school night. And I was like putting off her going to bed and you know, I was like, okay, she needs to get to bed. Like, it's already 9.15. And I was like, well, it's her birthday. Like, her last night being seven. Like, does she have to? And he was like, looking at me like I was crazy. And then I just lost it and started crying. And I was like, but once she goes to bed, she's never going to be seven again. And yeah, I, I lost it. And I just started hysterically crying. So, I mean, are we surprised? No, but I was doing really good though. Like I was like honestly doing so good and I didn't even like feel super emotional. Like usually I can like feel myself like I'm gonna cry, I know I'm gonna cry and I like have to force myself to hold back the tears. But I wasn't like that at all today. But I think it's honestly because I was like so busy and like low key stressed about like making sure the house looked good you know what i mean so i don't even really think about like think about it i don't know if that makes sense and then of course i was giving myself mom guilt i was like telling you mom i was like i was like so worried about cleaning the house i should have been more worried about like getting extra cuddles with her because it's her last day being seven and then I was just like mom guilt but I do this every year and I was like you do this every year like you get upset that like, like she spent more time or blah 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 and I'm like yeah I am I literally do it every year so like watch tomorrow I hope you guys can hear me over like all this cutting and shit because I'm also talking really quiet because like a laundress room is right there but you know, I yeah, I I do I give myself mom guilt over something every single year. So like watch tomorrow I'm gonna be like she was at school all day and I didn't get to spend time with her. Like I could totally picture that happening because that's just me. But is anybody else like that? Because ah oh, it's just 
I don't know. It's like it's like one of those things. It's like the ha one of that. It's literally the happiest day of my life, giving birth to her. You know, like the happiest day of my freaking life. But then like. It's funny because now it's like one of the saddest days of my life. I'm gonna cry right now. Just, you know, she's never gonna be seven again. Like, never. Oh my God, here I go, I'm gonna start crying again. Oh, Brittany, but I don't know. It's just, it's really hard for me. Birthdays are hard for me, so. Anyways, we got the last present wrapped. All of her presents are like so tiny. I have a feeling she's gonna be like, why are they all so small? Like, I just, I don't know. I, that makes me a little nervous that she's gonna be like, everything's so small, like, wow. <laughs> but, I don't know. I feel like as they get older, like the presents are like more small because they're not in like huge packaging. I don't know, but where did I put, oh my God, I got so scared. I was like, where is this? I think I'm gonna put the gift card and the card. Um, I do just need to write in the card and I need to print out, I need to print out the thing and then wrap that. Oh my God, it's 12.08. Oh, I'm, so, I'm so upset that I fell asleep because I could probably be asleep right now. It's okay. For my baby so it's worth it but all right i want to like print something um because if i can just say it because well, hello this is going to go up way after her birthday we're going to san diego for her birthday so if i print the itinerary i feel like she's going to be like what is this cool do you know what i'm saying so i want to print like something that says like we're going to san diego um so yeah that's what i want to do um but now that means I have to like design something. So I gotta, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do. All right, I didn't film myself, but that's okay, right? So I have it in here. I just printed it out on a piece of paper. So she's gonna see this and think it's like a big present and be like, wait, what? Also, she might be confused because it's super duper light. But yeah, so I got her presents. Those are the ones for my mom that she did not open. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these on the table out in the living room. And then I'm gonna take my ass to bed <laughs> because I am so tired, but I am done. So I am really, really excited and cannot wait to go to sleep. I feel like, can you tell? I really, really wanna go to sleep, but I wish I would've vlogged more. Um, but honestly, like at the nail salon, didn't really get to. And then also too, like once everybody was here, we were just hanging out, talking, having a good time. So I didn't really think to film as much, but um, yeah, it was honestly really good. I don't know if I said that earlier when I like first checked in, but it was really good. And Alondra had so much fun and she loved being able to like have everyone at her house and getting her nails done. Um, so I'm really glad that we had this like non-birthday party party. I think we called it a birthday play date is what we said we were gonna call it. Um, so I don't know. Anyways, I'm glad we were able to do that for her. Just, just seeing her happy makes me happy. And that's all that I really care about. But anyways, I'm going to stop rambling so I can go to bed. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow for my baby's birthday. Mm, I can't believe it. Um, okay. Don't cry, Brittany. Just take your ass to bed. But all right. Thanks for watching. Bye, muchachos. Bye.